quick. So as of right now, there's three daily challenges. Um, and they equal 80 points. So doing all three of these almost gives you one level. Personally, these should all be 100. And there also should be about, I would say five dailies. Personally, I think there should be five different dailies. They should all be worth 100 and two or three of them should be worth five influence points instead. At that rate, you have more stuff to do within the day. So that's like a good like two or three hours of doing those five dailies. You're also getting about 15 influence to use on one person or to save for somebody else. Um, wow, I never redeemed Wrench's mask yesterday. <laughs> um, and then also as far as the dailies or the weeklies, I think they're okay for now, but cause they each give you 300, I think. What is in your opinion, the best weapon as far as multiplayer? Um, Personally, right now, for multiplayer, I think, honestly, probably the MP5, silenced MP5, I would say. But I've also seen um, some people love using the uh, the M249 because it does deal a lot of damage. But I love using the MP5 a lot myself. Um, the It kind of sucks because the... the uh, I think they have more health or something because a lot of the non-lethal weapons they barely do any damage you can't get one hit headshots for the most part in multiplayer which kind of makes it a little rough at times um so yeah that's not the easiest thing in my opinion um or the the best situation but Hopefully they get a buff, to be honest. Um, I don't know, though. Because the game can be hard at times. Like, some of the missions are actually difficult. Like, legitimately difficult. Not just like, oh, it's... Like, yesterday I had a full team of people. And we got wiped out. Like, some of the missions we finished no problem, like, pretty quick. But other missions we literally got wiped out a few times um so yeah i can definitely range on difficulty wise um as far as multi the gun for online though i really like the the mp5 any mp5 character is really nice to have um trying to think if i want to go for the construction worker with the cargo drone or if I want to go for an Albion character finally um hmm. this guy's dressed out in <laughs> yo Kreese yeah thank you for the file there I appreciate it <laughs> this guy is dressed out in all clan kelly stuff but he's not a part of clan kelly he's an amateur hitman but he has a motorcycle he has an albion uh extra faction damage and then he also has a revolver so when i saw that i was like wow he's actually pretty pretty decent yes or tomorrow we won't be able to do or hopefully tomorrow if we complete this then we'll be able to recruit the professional hitman uh, the leader of the pack stuff. Uh, so actually, I think I'm going to do that. Yeah, I'm on, I am on PC. Good news is I actually saw a tweet, um, the other day, which is really neat that, um, uh, they're going to they're currently working on getting um cross play and cross platform progression supposedly
it was actually just like from the, their Twitter um, they're talking about it for a few seconds saying how they're they're currently working on it so I thought that was pretty cool all right so I didn't actually read what we need to do today ah shoot <laughs> we need a free handcuff civilians basically I mean I guess that's not too bad we just need to find some uh, defeat enemies with hijacked drones that's not too bad knock out enemies with melee attacks okay because of that melee one uh, I am going to do this where's my person this guy this guy is pretty good um, at fighting because obviously I got him through uh, through uh, this but I think PC players are are always are better right uh yeah it depends <laughs> there's definitely uh, a possibility whoa those are some interesting it's an interesting tag of abilities gain drone allegiance and anti-chase huh I never really understand the gain drone allegiance ability because you can learn that ability by doing anything how do you have 13 team spots I only have 12 um maybe this guy doesn't count as one I'm not too sure to be honest hold on one sec what was that yeah I didn't really add anything new um so huh. oh would you look at that wait what that guy just fell to the ground also what were the odds of that my mouse is like moving very slow right now but it's fine when we're up weird it's like almost as if the sensitivity is really low how do you get the special operatives um so one of them is a free operative that you can get um online if you look up so this guy prestige operative if you look up el rubius um code and you can actually go online and redeem him and you get him he's decent not really in online because he has um only non-lethal except for this the weapon can be pretty good but it, these guys you get from having i think it's the ultimate edition of the game but i'm a part of uh ubisoft plus so that's how i got them um ubisoft plus you gain uh this urban jungle pack which is these three people but you can buy them individually if you really wanted to but personally um they're meh they're just part of it for myself this guy is pretty good though i will say this uh tattoo artist the viper he's pretty pretty decent this guy is actually i honestly rotate between these two a lot her not so much but she does have uh hacks propagate so they constantly go to other people which is pretty nice um and then what else she has the homing beacon and her hacks regenerate faster um, one thing I think I'm gonna start doing is changing the non-lethal weapons because a lot of these people the pistol it, at least right now is very underpowered um, even with the silencer which is honestly pretty annoying it does have a silencer on it but um at least my upgraded one does but it's not uh very good when you get into combat so i'm swapping them out real quick trying to get this into 
the, the submachine gun is number one and then the other one in slot two So yeah besides that though honestly as little as like online online doesn't have a lot of stuff right now but i'm finding it a lot of fun and i think it's just because it's more watchdogs and it like changes every day as far as objectives so like right now we only need one more uh one more civilian luckily in by tomorrow we'll have new weeklies available so those will level you up i don't know how some people are actually rank 50 already i am rank 16 and i feel like i put in a lot of time so <laughs> i'm wondering how people are like rank 60 or 50 already and uh those people are like fiending for more It, the only problem is right now personally i don't think this game actually respects your time um with the amount of xp that you get for solo missions it's 30 that's half of what you get for the playlist co-op missions personally the co-op missions should be at least 100 because that means if there are 100 if you do three missions then you will go up one level right now at level at 60 you have to do like what is that uh three missions will put you at 180 then you need to do like six missions six or seven to level up that's crazy in my opinion some of them go quick but other ones take like 15 to 30 minutes especially depending on how efficient your team is too in my opinion that's a lot that's really a lot if these were like the solo activities were i would say 60 to 80 that would be more reasonable because you're doing them by yourself so that's not too bad hopefully this gives a good amount of xp the leader of the pack tactical op but we'll see um and then yeah the delivery parcels um they're the the most efficient as far as time because right now you can get some that give you 25 and they take under two minutes to complete so 25 hold on So if you do 12 parcel deliveries that are uh, level 20 or that give you 25 XP, you'll hit go up one level and 12 parcel deliveries would take you about if they're two minutes or less, it takes you about 30 minutes, give or take. So that's 24 minutes. So every half an hour, you can go up two levels that's very very slow progress or every every hour you can go up two level two levels that's what i meant to say that's very slow progress in my opinion um granted what i was saying with this 15 minutes well some of them go pretty fast i don't really see any missions that go any longer than like 15 20 but depending on which one you get it definitely can take that so yeah um this actually isn't too bad the city event i just realized it's 60 points about the same as doing the co-op playlist let me see i'm still gonna save my points actually for tomorrow um and hopefully unlock the the professional hitman but we'll see on that whoa kiara uh okay so challenges 
melee attacks handcuffed and i uh hijacked drones that's not too bad we need to find handcuffed people basically where is the albion uh guys yeah, right. do you know where the albion people are do you know Auto we're looking for enabled. people Kiara, we gotta find the people that are being arrested and free them okay we need to find one more all right i need you to go search for them okay go look for them once you find them then i'll give you a treat okay if you find one kiara i will give you a treat oh you like that it should go Uh, I had still haven't seen any drone experts online either. And I, I've been searching like all the places that you can find them single player. Um, but I haven't, I haven't found any yet, which is kind of weird. Right now we're just looking for the Albion people. Uh, it's kind of funny how right where I spawned there was a person arrested. The one other thing we can do too, that actually would be pretty smart for today, I would say, since we need to defeat like three people. Oh wait, that's the- uh, Auto drive now um, disabled. This is a spy here. Let's see, there is one. Who is it though? He's basically like identical to the spy I have right now. Almost. Auto drive now enabled. This person going on a jog. Heading to Nine Elms to eat. Woodworker. We do see a lot of woodworkers. Not exactly sure where we can find any of the um the people arrested. Auto drive now disabled. <sighs> the one thing that would actually make it really easy if I did have an Albion character, um then you're you're actually able to <laughs> it's it's pretty funny too. You can actually just run up to people and throw handcuffs on them and then take the handcuffs off. Um, I could recruit somebody, but if I do that, I won't have enough points to unlock the hitman tomorrow. So it's kind of like, which one would I rather have? Oh, here we go. Oh, that guy is better than the other guy I have. Don't worry, sir. I'll, I'll free you in a second. You know what? Not my Jeez. There it is. Challenge complete. Oh, God. All right, fine. Bring it on. Oh god. Oh no! Hit the wrong guy. Oh! That's it. Wrong one! There it is. Okay. Well, that's one thing done. We have a visual on the suspect. I feel like my, uh... My sensitivity went down so much. If I see one character that has Gunkata available, I don't think I've ran into any of them yet. 
But if I do run into one, I'll probably save them for a point. <laughs> Whenever this guy's drunk, he suspected of stealing alcohol. Yeah, I can see that just from his bio. All right, we're gonna find a, a fight club. Wherever there is one, I think. Um, so apparently this one right here is the only one that gives you, is it Camden? Yeah. It gives you 30 points of XP instead, 20. decent abilities that's like on par with uh, her abilities so who do I one of these people this guy does it say use betray hack briefly making drone an ally yeah but the weird thing is you can do that with anybody so well at least with the ability that I have um, she's actually pretty good. Key and shock. <laughs> Fashion illustrator. Alright, so we're going to run over to the fight club. And that should, so on top of that, we'll actually get some decent XP and... Um, well, not some de it's, it's not necessarily decent, but it's okay. <laughs> XP. We'll get some okay XP, and then we'll also be completing the objective while in the, the fight arena. Oh, God. I saw it lag there. I think I'm going to try getting a new Ethernet cable. Um, and see if that helps with the lagging at all. Yeah, so this one does give you 30. Okay. Oh, I can taste the tension in here. Our fighters are ready, are you? Well, you'd better be. Bits are closed, and we're ready to run. A solid hit. That's the shit we like to see of our own people all want. Damn. Oh, there's one. The fighters step into the light. Take a look at those faces. Place your bets and strap the fuck in. Oh, they're going to feel that hit in the morning if they wake up. Almost not their teeth right now. And that's a hit. One for the record books. There it is. Place your bets, fight lovers. These tattoos are kind of cool. They're poised, they're ready, they're wild and unsteady. Get on your feet and let them in. Oh, shit, and that's a solid blow down. Just like a proper live highlight reel. <laughs> right onto their back. I don't think I fought these guys yet. These two don't give a monkey's about the rules and neither do we. Hope you're ready to bleed. Did you all see that monster on the stream? Fucking hell! This will be a nice, easy warm-up. Oh, my God! What 
Wait, finish. There it is. I think one of the, yeah, see like this guy. Damage up after counters. Take slash deal more damage. Melee charges gadgets. I'm good on both of them though. Uh, okay, so does that count towards the objective? It does. We only need three more, so one more uh, fight club. Uh, come back later. Oh. Did they really patch that so that way you can't do them over and over? No way, dude. What? You used to be able to go in and out. I'm picking up an imminent threat in this area. You literally could just exit and then launch. Oh my god. I wonder if they changed anything with the parcel deliveries too. That's honestly kind of rough. It's kind of like, why would you do that? In my opinion. Let's go to the, uh, the museum. You just need to beat up three people. Um, I could go to a different area, but I don't really care. If I find any guys on the street too, that, that works for me. So yeah, straight ahead. Oh, nice. Medical uniform. Vendor with the scooter and a stun gun. I think we have to go around the other side. Yeah, looks like it. Okay. Let me grab a car. I really need a my my sensitivity. I don't know what happened, but it's like extremely low now. So let me bump it up. Yeah, what the heck? I I didn't even change it. English, auto steering. I guess that's better. I don't know. It feels weird. That's 400 DPI. There's 600. That's 800. This feels like... I don't know. I'm not like moving it a whole lot, but... This feels like less than usual. I guess. House and keyboard. Look sensitivity and that. What was that? Hacking aim assist. I don't know exactly what that does. Oh. Oops. Oh God. I've been here so many times now, actually. That's funny. All right, I'm coming through. Fight me. Sorry, Kiara. In the face.
No. Ending search. I could have taken him down. Come on, bring it, bring it. He literally ran inside. Wait, does that count as taking down somebody? I uh, know it has to be a. Uh, so it has to be actually taking them down. All right. Well. Hack a server. This one is upload that. Feel the surveillance device. Do that. I guess, I mean, we could do this one. That's probably what I should have done from the beginning is just ran some, uh, some co-op or solo missions, whatever. But whatever, dude. So we need, yeah, we'll we'll have enough points to go up one level. Like three levels, three levels a day, I think is reasonable. What the heck? I think this is one of the people that I have targeted. Is she? No. And she's gone. Okay. Whoops. Whoops. Arm steel. I'm gonna take this instead. Lucky you. There's a shipment that needs to be destroyed, and it has your name on it. Heading there now. I join uh, I'm in a public lobby but that's uh, fine with me I don't know how long I'm gonna be on to be honest because I'm almost done the last daily but um, but yeah my I'm also on PC by the way oh god it's I could see it's, it was lagging there for a second. Yeah, I'm on PC as well. Okay. My uh, Ubisoft is Cassis Clay. Same as my Twitch username. This is the place. I'd be alright with running some missions. I have another friend that might be open to it as well. So I forget what was our objective. Oh yeah. Hijack drones. Off to a good start. Is a new acting strange. How many is that? Two? We need three more. I'm assuming that's yours. Jamez. Sent it? Sounds good. One sec.
there it is. And okay. One sec. I'm gonna get out of this place right here. And I think I might do a private lobby. I just hit 17. For rank. Rank wise, at least. Thought I had a buddy on. Let me check. Um, it, it runs okay for me sometimes. Uh, I have a twenty seventy super. And I'm also streaming, so sometimes when I'm streaming, it does go down a little bit. But besides that, it's not horrible. Um, it's it's okay. Yeah, it runs all, all right. It's not like the the best game ever, but it it, it does the job. I would say. Um, I do feel like it is running a little bit better than originally. I guess my buddy's not all night anymore. Um, but, but yeah. Like I would say, especially while I'm streaming, I get about, uh, I would say like 40, 45 to like 60 sometimes, um, but depends. It definitely depends. Now I'm absolutely not on max settings. <laughs> I'm on like customized, uh, myself mainly here yeah, i'll start at friends only one um i have like dlss on and stuff so like right now i'm getting about 50 frames but it do definitely drops here and there um yeah be sync off all that good stuff most of my stuff is like high or medium for the most part, some things just completely turned off. Reflections, motion blur, bloom, all that is turned off. Ray tracing is turned off. DLSS is on, but set to performance. Um, I never realized. Huh. Performance has a higher CPU load than balanced or quality. Interesting. I'm gonna try it balanced yeah it kind of goes all over the place I do have the frames in the top left but like right now it's about it see the thing is it says I'm getting 40 or so right now it's about 38 40 but it feels smoother than that personally like compared to another game that you get 48 or 30 i don't know with ray tracing all the fps tanks from 75 all the way down to 30 on a good day yeah so i don't know i don't know how accurate the there's a an option in game isn't there to, oh god oh god i didn't mean to do any of that I think there's an option where you can actually see. Oh my god. That's it. Using 
I'm pretty sure there's a button you can press or a key you can press in game to be able to see your frames. Also, I, I see that for some reason it's dropping a little bit on my other monitor here and there. I don't know why or well on my stream PC, but it's not like dropping that bad for me. As bad as it's showing at least. Um, there's one thing I can actually check in a second here. This seems to help sometimes. <laughs> he said, I guess. I'm going to change it back to... Uh, Where'd it go? Performance. Ah, I was looking for a getaway driver for a while now, but eh, I don't know if I want her. Oh god. Weapons dealer. Damn, son. Damn, you better run faster than that. You just shot shot him right in front <laughs> he's heading to the hospital now you might want to run Jesus how do you do my shit looks and smells better don't know me I'm gonna swap to this guy for now. Oops. Oh no. Shit. What uh what level are you? Or rank, I guess, technically. I wonder if the ranks reset all the way. Like once you hit, like once the, the rank in 49 days, or if it'll be like, remain that, I don't know. Rank six, oh, okay. <laughs> that's not bad. It just, I mean, it, that's, that's fair. Cause it just came out. I guess technically console people would have, have had it for a few weeks now. Hold on for one sec, I'm just doing this real quick. Trying to reset this. See if it helps at all. So yeah, console people have had it for about four weeks now, so I guess Yeah, I've been seeing um a lot of people have hit max rank already. As far as console. I think there should be a little bit more um XP abilities and things like that. I think there should be more options. Oh, sh I keep pressing E. That's the second time. <laughs> yeah, if you want to type in game chat, that's fine too. That works for me. Um, I think we might actually even launch one of these. Bear parts. I don't know if I did this one yet.
Oh, really? It didn't invite you? Since the bombings. I'm sorry. This is not oh. a problem that will go away on its own. We can either uh... expose Albion's scheme, or we can start sending flowers to these protesters' families. I'm well equipped to do either. Hold on. I'm gonna back out to the main menu. Um, I don't think... I don't think I'm gonna play much more of this today, because tomorrow night I'll be playing a ton. Um, anyways, just to let you know, I'm probably gonna hop off here in maybe like 15 or 20 minutes off this game and jump onto another one. But tomorrow night, um, with the update and everything, I'll be I'll be playing for sure, and I think I have a buddy that I'll be playing as well. And then, if we want, if you're on as well, then we can squad up everybody. Basically. Yeah, I can't even join your game. Or That's weird that you can't invite from the menu. Maybe that works. Huh. Okay, I guess that works. All right, then. It's weird it didn't try inviting you too. I'm gonna check this real quick and see if there's any. No way. Did they patch this? Oh. Lots of people will pay well to have their sensitive packages handled with care, and some will even pay you I thought they took away all of the XP for these. They made it so you can only do fight clubs one time now. You used to be able to do them over and over again, as many times as you want. Now you can only do uh, the fight club one time and then it tells you come back later. Yeah, and the one in the top left My on the map over in Camden Town, in this area. Um, Stick around. Your services may be needed. you were able to do, uh, you could, you would get 30 XP from up there. But I just tried doing one tonight and I was only able to do it one time and now it says come back later. Surprisingly doing the parcel deliveries are actually pretty good for XP. But I was talking about it earlier, you only go up. If you do it for one hour, you go up two levels. <laughs> Meanwhile, if you do the dailies, which can take anywhere from like 30 minutes to an hour, you go up by almost one level. Well, I would say they don't really take that long, so I don't know. I think the balancing system as far as leveling up right now is very off. It's very, very slow and time consuming. Like it's, it's definitely on more of the grindy side of a online leveling system the update so right now over oh god sorry that might have been loud guys <laughs> also yo thank you for the follow there i appreciate it um so tomorrow the update that comes out it's going to be for this mission right here the leader of the pack so it's essentially like four or five missions that are combined together. And then if one person dies, the mission resets. I don't think it's all of the missions. It's just the one that you're currently on. So, um, and then if you have, if you have like a spy or not a spy, a professional hitman like this guy. So he can only be unlocked after you complete the leader of the pack which is that mission so right now i'm saving my 30 points 
So that way tomorrow, hopefully after we complete it, then I'll be able to use those points and unlock him. So, yeah. Um, that's the plan at least. <laughs> that is the plan. So we'll see how that actually ends up going. Um, I hope it works out. I just think that this game needs a little bit better. Uh, I definitely think it needs a little bit better XP and more things to do. I understand that more things to do will come with time, but there's enough in Watch Dogs where, oh God, where if you had the XP available, then uh, I feel like people would be able to keep themselves busy enough like by themselves without requiring too much like this is kind of like GTA in a way like in in that aspect one second I'm just checking some stuff um, the thing keeps dropping a little bit I don't know what's causing it to freeze up does it let you look at each other? Or, oh, I thought you were looking at my character. It's funny how it tells you who that person is looking at. I, I really hope that they, they develop more stuff for online mode. I would love to see online mode have a ton of options for stuff to do and and be reasonable on like uh leveling and, and things like that if i can hit 50 in this 100 percent, i'll do it um if it's reasonable if they increase the rewards or anything like that uh or give more options faster way of getting to 50 then i would do it the cool thing is all the stuff that you unlock too, it gets unlocked in single player as well. So you can use it there if you really want to. Um, I really want this thing. I want that. This is kind of cool, but I also want, uh, I want this, which I'm only one. Yes, I'm pretty sure you get reset when the season's over. Yeah, exactly. And then it'll be new rewards for the next season. The crazy thing is, and, and this is my opinion right now, but once you hit level 50, right now at least, there's practically no way of getting more uh, influence other than logging in uh, a few times a week. And even then you only get three influence. I feel like personally three influence is like a slap in the face. That's like, here, do this thing. Here's three inf influence. If it was like, if it was five and there was multiple uh, challenges that gave you like five influence, then that I understand. But three for only one, that's like so difficult especially when you have characters like this guy if you want a good character he costs 30. so if say if you spend all your time using your influence building a team and then you only have like low grade people all your money you're not gonna have like any influence to get like the higher end people so all those people that are like level 50 are gonna have like they'll have basic uh people to use but they won't have like high-end people to use or, or like people that are more special than the rest um but hold on for one sec um i'm gonna do something real quick um and if we can get into a co-op mission i'm fine with doing i guess a few
because I, I am enjoying this like this the online mode in general like I really do like it it's just <laughs> it's it's hard to uh with how little there is sometimes so right here is a spy actually standing right there in front of us i know better than to stick around and he is 30 points to recruit is he right there for you like you see him and everything Yeah, I saved them. Okay, nice. What's his, uh, what is his name? I'm just curious if it's the same person. Is it Cornelius? Cornelius Anderson? Or is it somebody else? Yeah. Huh. That's interesting. I guess technically you can see, uh, the same people. And recruit them, too. Um, there's one interesting thing I know you can do, too. So I can see your current guy and more MCX rifle and he does extra faction damage. Yeah, I, I did save him. <clears throat> I technically could recruit him right now too, but, um, but I, I'm saving my points for tomorrow. yeah no trust me i get that i think the spy is like the first person oh geez the spy is like one of the first people i actually recruited whoops so i i think i i came into the online mode with i think you you start since i have the ultimate edition i think you start with a few more influence points so i came in with like um i think it was like 40 or 40 or 60 or something like that okay yeah so maybe i did use it on that yeah he was one of the first people that i actually recruited especially because like how useful they can be and it's nice because they don't have like any level requirements or anything yeah if you level up you'll have enough so right here the people that that turn people um what's it called is it an amateur hitman it is I actually like some of the amateur hitmans. Some of them are pretty cool. Some of them can be just as good as uh, like a regular hitman too if they have a, a stack of abilities. This guy right here is a amateur hitman. And he's only 10. But he only has a pistol. That's the only thing. Um, so right here. Sometimes the. Uh, the hypnotizers spawn. This person. With the pocket watch. Uh, sometimes they spawn right here. I don't think I've really actually seen them on online. But they they have a possibility of doing it. Um, ooh, it is nighttime. So uh, to save time, actually go up here to Brewer Street.
Because, so the professional hitman only spawns from everything I've seen at night. So, and it looks like they're here right now too. Yep. Right here. <laughs> Recruits at maximum capacity. Wait, wait, I need a clear one. I don't need her. Yep, so. That's pretty nice too. And he's the one that once you complete the game, or once you complete the mission tomorrow, you'll be able to recruit him. This guy is T-posing for me. <laughs> oh, my dog's barking to come in. You have incurred a parking violation and been issued a penalty charge. Please pay the full. And apparently, I guess it's pretty interesting. Because tomorrow. They have some good people that spawn in here as well. Sometimes there's another T poser. I guess the the mission tomorrow. I can have 13. I don't know how somebody else said that earlier too. I have 13 operative or can have 13. And then I can have 20 recruits potential recruits maybe oh you know what maybe these don't count towards the team so that's one two three four five six seven eight nine so maybe it gives me four extra because i have these guys Maybe that's it. What's this guy? Extra damage and disorient. I like the tear gas stuff. I don't know where this objective is going to start tomorrow. Oh, actually, maybe right here. Yeah. Oh, okay. I see. going to be starting down here. That guy has an AK-47. Eat on a royal white wall drunk. You crashed? Oh man. I actually like some of the like hitman and stuff that you can get. I'm gonna get rid of that person. I'm gonna clear these out real quick. Definitely need that at some point. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this guy. I'm probably never going to recruit them. Keep that. Keep the amateur hitman. This guy seems pretty cool. Is it? Reduce damage taken from all sources. Okay. She is good because she has the electrify and the short hacks. Maybe I'll recruit her someday. This guy is pretty good because he has the melee weapon, extra damage. This guy I can get rid of now. This guy I want to keep because he has the shorter arrest Stay time. Alert. There is a situation developing here. And unlimited range. Same thing with. And no, I kind of go back and forth though. A, the info things are always so interesting to me. <laughs> I 
and then we have two professional hitmen that are like identical to each other. But honestly, the more people that you have that have like special abilities and guns, those are more effective in the online so far. Like these people haven't been very useful from my experience so far. crash but you saved them good that one guy still was pretty cool though wherever they want the veteran dude this country is going to hell in a hand basket. Escape Pursuit Faster, Web Developer. More T posing. <laughs> All right, we can try online. Um, if it doesn't work out, I might play something else for the next hour and a half. But tomorrow night for sure, um, I'll be on. So let's let's see if we can get into a, a game here. Okay, now it's voting. There we go. Nice. This one is an interesting area, so. I'm gonna swap characters. I'm gonna go for, yeah, I'm gonna go for her. There's a lot of drones here. and other things, so. Let's see how this goes. Oh my God. Oh God. I'm bleeding out already. I just walked in. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my God, dude. I'm going to try to run up here. security system if you find the key cards for the ctos up you should unlock the server Put it in. oh my god how do they both go down what the hell 
Oh god. Oh. The body is spazzing. Smell it, yo, what's going on, TNG Senpai? <laughs> Yeah. Uh, I don't know. These guys need to grab the keys. Am I grabbing them all? I hear the body <laughs> getting thrown around. Oh my god, what is going on? Is he dead? Oh, that's actually a decent uh, equipment. Did that, somebody grab the last key? Oh, download the app from the server. There you go. Beep boop beep. Deploying drones to apprehend the suspects. Ah, uh, okay. Ouch. <laughs> Jesus. Wait, where's the teammate at? Why are they all the way down there? What the hell? Oh my god. Wait, destroy them, destroy them. Oh god, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead. I wish, the, this is the only time I would wish that that turret was still online. Is this my character that hacks propagate? Yeah, they do. That definitely was not supposed to be there. But A, it works. Oh God. Oh God. by a failsafe that overheats the device on which it's installed. In this case, the self-driving car over there. Jeez. The failsafe is kept in check by an external authenticator, which is now installed on the other vehicle. You have to steal both cars and keep them close together to prevent the app from blowing up the engine. <laughs> this guy is standing up for me. All right, this is the dangerous part. Having to stick together long enough where uh, the two vehicles are close. Will not be tolerated. Let's get moving. Stay close. <laughs> He's riding a bike. Alright, we're good, I guess.
Aha. Stay close. This is a different drop off than last time. You have reached your destination. Wow. Please apply the handbrake and leave the weaponized car for collection. Brilliant. We'll huh. transfer the local file to a secure DeadSec server. Keep Albion from, you know, blowing people to bits. Hey, jam yourself, yeah? Yeah! Wavy! Don't tell me it's the same. Oh, wait, no. Uh, killing protesters admitted to thing. Dead sick can put a stop to it. Hack the hospital servers to collect evidence for this scheme. It's not the same one, is it? No, it's different. Connie's found some dirt on St. Thomas's Hospital. According to online reports, several protesters admitted for protest related injuries have died from complications. What happened? Did it just break? Did my game crash? The weird thing is, the. The Bloom logo. Oh, wait, no, it's still good. What? Okay. Weird. I'm here. Word of warning. There are two high-ranking officers who have direct access to the hospital server. If you are detected, these guards will likely engage emergency lockdown measures, making access to the server impossible. So, bottom line, if you trigger the alarm, find these guards and stop them from ruining our entire plan. All right, so we need to try to be stealthy here. That's easy enough. Go to sleep. Oh no, stop, stop right there. And go to sleep. Left to keep us from the server, besides the rest of these gun wielding knobs. Oh, God. This mission gets very difficult if you actually get detected, too. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Oh, this is this would be smart if I had an Albion character. caught I she pulled out a gun on me so I guess technically yes oh dude this is a perfect spot I didn't know that oh shoot oh, well. well do my hacks aren't oh maybe you have to do them on people 
disable. Oh wait, you know what I just realized too? I think this goes faster if I join in. That's pretty cool there. That actually disrupted all of them. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Move, move, move. Oh my god. Oh god. Hijack. No, can't hijack it. Betray, betray, hijack. Got it. Dude, I don't understand. It's okay if I go down. Don't don't worry about me. I'll I'll regen or respawn as somebody else. She wasn't ready for this. <laughs> We're going to jail today. Drone's been deployed to apprehend. Rested. Oof. Uh, okay. Who should I come in as? I'm going to swap to her. Because her allegiance might help. Wait, do we fail the mission? Or... Oh, shoot. Hold on. I got you. I got you. I got you. Ah! No! Damn it. Are you kidding me? Leave me alone. <laughs> Jeez. Come out and fight. You've got a sudden urge to turn on all your mates. This might actually be worth doing. What the? Okay. <laughs> Spawn right on me. <laughs> they look like zombies. Are they two old ladies? I think they might be two old ladies. Oh my god, we can't move. Don't worry guys, grandma's here! Jesus Christ.
I turned that shit down so fast. Why was that so loud, dude? Jesus Christ, dude. And off the edge. Sierra 42, this is control. An alarm has been activated near you. Survey the area. I was trying to figure out how to disable that. Dude, that was so annoying. I have the, the in-game voice chat turned down too, which is crazy. So I can only imagine how loud, the, how loud that was on regular volume. Well done. I've uncovered something else from the hospital server. A vehicle Albion uses to deliver the tainted medicine to the hospital. The GPS within that vehicle is the last nail in the coffin of this deadly affair. Consider this a prescription from Dr. Bagley. One <laughs> dose of motor They line up best. like three That's bikes. The you're looking for there. We have a delivery point. One of Connie's mates will take the vehicle from there. In the meantime, do something about all this, won't you? Oh no! Turning left, trying to turn left. Backing in. Connie, about that Albion poisoning patients in hospital scheme. We have data from the hospital server and the delivery vehicle's GPS. Why would you Tom leave Banks, when we're delivering the, the vehicle? Okay. When you get a moment, would you? I know a few thirsty journalists who'd love to help us tell the world what kind of care people have been getting here. Step aside, peasants. <laughs> I'll do one more mission. And then... Yeah, one more mission. And then, I don't know. Figure it out. I don't know if I want to go back to... Uh... Yeah, we'll see. Oh god, this mission? My Albion informant oh, tells no. me they're working on a drone software update to this take mission, down known dead just sex the two of us all over the might city. be a little difficult, Albion's but we can try it. Support initiative, quite literally. Oh, just oh brilliant. The update is stored on two synchronized devices in the area. You will need to hack both for me to nuke the patch. Better sleep. Oh, 
Well, I was going to try being stealthy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about this mission. This one's going to be pretty difficult, to be honest. Yeah. Uh, dude, I hate how overpowered these guys are. Swap to this guy. <laughs> I love it. Shotgun's gonna fuck you up. Oh, nice. We have another person here now. Okay, yeah, we should be able to do this now. Um, yeah, there it is. Coming, I'm going, I'm going. Got it. On the bright side, I've deleted the update into Albion's database of known dissidents. However, the update already went out to some sort of experimental drone. I could summon the drone with access to the central antenna. pretty cool this security system has a timed lockout switch and multiple redundant circuits you might need to coordinate to crack this one all right time to take care of this fun thing I actually like these things on a, a real note Majority of the time, they're actually not bad. Take it to that, and that. There's up there. Top. that goes back down okay and here good almost got that that's good that back up top And you have to do that really quick. Oh God. Nice. There it is. They've noticed you. Security's on their way. Here comes the big guns.
Oh God. But like trying to go one way. Sixty percent, not bad. sucks in online mode that you can't swap out lethal weapons with other characters i think that's the the hardest part because that means basically anybody as of right now like non-lethal people aren't like really great uh right now i'm using the i'll show you them but Also, thank you for the follow there. I'm currently using the Viper, which is MP5, Light Step, and Takedown Thief. Also, uh, thank you for the follow there. I appreciate it. I just have them in a, a different outfit I think than we pissed them off. So default. So if we upload the shutdown command directly, it will trigger a temporary overload, exposing weak spots. Oh god, this thing. This thing. I suggest targeting the weak spot. Fire. Ah. And it's immune. Imagine joining this game now. Ugh, lucky that guy. I I will say though, the one time I joined some of these games, uh, like on the first day I played multiplayer, I joined a game as they were finishing the mission. And it was really nice. I still got the full like 60 XP too. Jesus. Yeah, this guy's pretty good. So this guy you actually get, um, I'm a part of Ubisoft Plus, which is their uh, subscription. It's like 15 bucks, but you get all the Ubisoft games and the Ultimate Editions. Um, so the Ultimate Edition actually comes with this guy and uh, these two people, Veteran and this girl as well. So that's how I get them, but you can technically get them from here. It's this guy right here that I'm currently using. Um, but the ultimate edition, because Ubisoft Plus comes with the highest edition of each uh, character, uh, you basically get them for free. So, wait, I think we all have to jump into the water. <laughs> there it goes.
That's weird. You actually have to be in the water. And boom. Wait, what? That's weird. All three of us are here. It, it only registers, I guess, two. <laughs> the person's beeping. <laughs> you. Nice. Time to cool off. Chances are Albion will rebuild that drone, but this should hold them off for another day. Great work, you lot. Whenever Albion G -G. tries to strip this city of its voice, we'll be there to shut them right down. All right, uh, Lil Money, Jamez, yo, it was good playing, man. Um, I'm going to chill with Watch Dogs for now.